Harry's diary. Tuesday, the tenth of October. Today was not a brilliant day, but it wasn't bad. I got up late because I forgot to turn on my phone. It always wakes me up at seven twenty-three. If I don't get up, then Sarah, my older sister, gets to the bathroom before I do. She always takes seventeen minutes to wash her face, clean her teeth, and comb her hair. Ugh, sisters. So today I didn't wash before I got dressed. Never mind. I hope no one sees. Um, Dad was coughing a lot when I ran downstairs. He put salt and sugar in his coffee because he was listening to the news on the radio and reading his newspaper at the same time, and not looking at his spoon. Um, sausage or fat cat ate a spider. Only my little sister said, "Sausage might run faster now. She's got a spider inside her." My school shirt is pink. I've only got one at the moment. Mom washed it with my red football socks. Oh, I couldn't believe it! But pink is such a lovely color, Harry. Mom said, "I don't think my mom understands, boys." Uh, we had a new bus driver. Uh, when he opened his mouth to ask me for my ticket, uh, I saw that he had three gold teeth, like making Holly frightened. So I tell her scary stories sometimes. I love my little sister, but it's difficult to leave it sometimes. She broke our old computer. She put a biscuit in the hole where the CDs went. I had to hurry to get to school, but I got there at eight thirty-eight. William and Emma were already in the playground. Uh, when I was chatting them about about a program that I'm using to make a puzzle app, I put my rucksack next to theirs. Emma's rucksack and mine looked the same. And yes, of course, I picked up hers when I ran into class. No English dictionary, so I had to borrow one. No lesson timetables, no homework file, no phone, no geography book, but a dinosaur project, some glue, a pair of scissors, uh, some science homework, a picture of an octopus, and some expensive chocolate called paper. I ate the chocolate before I uh, I gave uh, Emma's rucksack back to her. I shouldn't do things like that, but it tasted delicious. Um, I played volleyball, but uh, it started to rain, so I took my sweater off, which was hiding my pink shirt. I wanted uh, I wanted the rain to change its color back to white again, but it didn't. It's still pink. Uh, in our next lesson. His story: A boy called Michael made a noise that sounded like a mouse, and whispered to Katie, who called out, "A mouse! A mouse!" Uh, our teacher, two of the girls, and my friend Richard jumped on their chairs. I tried not to laugh, but it was really funny. Uh, Mr. Brush, our school cleaner, uh, came to find it, but he couldn't, of course. Uh, then uh, we played uh, football, and I, I kicked the ball so high it went up onto the roof. Uh, when I climbed on to take it, I saw that there were three more footballs. So I've got four footballs now. Excellent! Today I missed the bus because um, I was chatting. With William to William, and um, I forgot to remember to go to the bus station, and uh, I must walk today. I didn't mind, but I had a shoulders, shirt, trousers, and shoes got really wet because it started to rain again. When Sarah, my older sister, saw me. She said, "Well, you needed a wash." Um, then I went upstairs to dry my hair and put my black T-shirt and jeans on. 
Uh, then I went to the kitchen to eat the dinner. Today we had fi uh, we had chips. I had fifty two. Then Holly gave me five of hers. So I had fifty seven. Excellent. What else? Oh, sausage came into the house with a pair of false plastic teeth in its mouth. It was really funny. I told Holly that they were great grandmas and that she lost them last weekend when she fell asleep in the garden. I did my information technology homework. Well, most of it. The Wi-Fi stopped and I must fa uh, find something online. Okay, my teeth are clean. None of my teeth are plastic. I put on my pajamas and uh, they've got spaceships on them. What's the time? Ooh, 9.45 and my phone is on so it knows I must wake up at 7.23. Good night, Walt. Walt. Good, good night, me. Huh? Oh no, that's a biscuit in my bed. Holly!